Okay, here we're going to show you our bird dog exercise. We're really, really going to work on our stability and core work here. We're going to start in a quadruped position. I want you to plant those toes underneath. Those hands are right under those shoulders. From here, I want you to think about giving a little, little baby tuck from the belly button down to your sacrum or your tailbone. So it's just this little bit of tuck to engage that lower abdomen, but keeping the upper back relaxed. From there, I'm just going to start with the leg work. From here, I'm going to extend my leg le left leg out, squeeze, hold for about a count of two, bring myself in. That's our easiest version of the bird dog, just moving that leg. We want to focus on keeping those hips square. That heel stays right in line with that glute. If we go too high, we create that arch in the back and we lose that core stability. Next version we're going to go to is our full bird dog. So I'm going to reach opposite arm, opposite leg. At the same time I reach my leg back, I'm going to reach that opposite arm forward, squeeze, hold for a count of two, bring myself back in, watching that I have that correct diagonal angle from my right hand to my left foot, bring myself in. If I want to make it more challenging, I can float the arm and leg. So I'm going to reach out the same way, keeping that foot flexed to keep, my, to keep all the pressure in the posterior side. Bring your hand and leg in. You can either float or come all the way to a touching position. Reach it back out, hold, and repeat about 10 times on both sides.